quality papaya is going to be orange like this, all right? I cut off the size, don't worry about that. It's gonna be orange like this, okay? And it's gonna be firm, but it's gonna have some give to it, like memory foam. So, if your papaya is not orange, you're just taking a gamble right off the bat, okay? Now let me show you what the inside should look like when you crack it open. This is what the inside should look like, guys. You see how rich this color is? See how it's almost like, almost blood, almost, honestly. Okay, that is how you tell. All right, it's amazing, soft, it's good. If you crack open your papaya and it's the color of like this liner right here, like pale yellow, it's, that's a garbage papaya. You want your papaya to look like this, okay? Just like this. And it's gonna taste amazing. A lot of people hate papaya because they haven't had quality papaya. You want it to taste just like this, all right, guys? All right, y'all, that's the video. I'm gonna enjoy this papaya. Just a little tip, you guys. If you're living in a spot like Colorado, Delaware, Connecticut, Maine, uh, Wisconsin, these places, they are super cold and quality fruit just doesn't, you can't get quality fruit too often like this. Like some types of fruit you might be able to get, but if you're in, like I came from Colorado, I'm in Florida now. If you're in Colorado, that right there does not exist. Um, but if you're looking for it, your best bet is to go to a Mexican market or an Asian market, okay? But if you wanna get quality fruit like that, especially papaya, you gotta go to a tropical climate, period. That does not exist in Colorado. I've never seen papaya like that ever in Colorado. It only exists in the tropics. All right.